20-year-old Elena Melendez was in the middle of the unrest in the old market during the second night of protests in May. That's when she says she saw Jake Gardner with a gun near 12th and Harney. I knew that I was going to have to act. In the video provided by the Douglas County attorney, you can see Melendez jump on Gardner's back and the two fall into a puddle. Melendez says she ran away. Moments later, she says she heard Gardner shoot Skurlock, then saw Skurlock in the street, and she told that to the grand jury. It feels like I'm a part of this case so much, yet I'm not. She wanted charges brought against Gardner, but she was still surprised when the grand jury indicted him for manslaughter. I was very excited, and after the evidence was revealed that it, most of the evidence came from Jake himself. I was very confused. Gardner's attorneys still maintain their client's innocence despite the special prosecutor's comments Wednesday. They say there was no new credible or relevant evidence showing Gardner's state of mind was to harm anyone. Melendez feels like there's no closure now that Gardner took his own life. I'm not sitting here and bouncing up in joy um, that the fact that Jake is dead. And she's still struggling with everything she's seen and heard. There's not a whole lot I know that I can do, especially at this point, you know, I've testified, I've done what I've needed to do.